to my channel. So I'm just gonna be honest and tell you that I'm not feeling very good this week. I've just had a lot of like headaches going on the past couple of days and I'm just not feeling 100%. But here I am to share my October birch box with you. And I'm so excited. First off, this box is freaking beautiful. Like that is the most perfect October box. It's just those nice, like darker type of colors and it's still just so pretty so pretty all right let's jump into it so my little card here says our aim this month take a breather and slow way down think masking while movie marathoning or using a night cream before getting a full night's rest no matter how you love to unwind we're bringing you rejuvenating products to make the most of your you time naps and cozy blankets strongly encouraged I like naps and cozy blankets. Got on the right track, brush box. And then on the back is my list of products, which I'm going to use to read off to you. The first thing is this Amika Nourishing Mask. And this is a hair mask. The full size is $12 to $28. It says it's packed with sea buckthorn berry, which is full, chock full of omegas, and I think it's pronounced jojoba oil. I don't think you pronounce them as J's. And let's see, this paraben free mask intensely hydrates strands while repairing damage and sealing frayed ends. I love hair masks. I use one like once a week to try and help my hair be all nice and, I don't know, healthy. I guess that's the word I'm looking for. Because I do dye my hair quite often. So I've started doing weekly conditioning masks to just kind of help it seal in some moisture and repair itself. So, yeah, that's exciting. Let's see, the second one is this lock. I'm guessing it's lock. Vibrant Matte Lipstick in Glam Life. The full size is $8, which actually isn't a bad price for a lipstick whatsoever. So it's this high pigment formula in a shade handpicked by Tati Westbrook. I think that's how you pronounce her name. Features a matte finish that lasts all day while staying comfortable. So here is the size of the sample. And then here is the color. Oh my gosh. This is like such a wonderful fall box. Oh, that's beautiful. That is like one of my favorite, favorite colors to wear in the fall because it's just that beautiful purpley red color and I'm just in love with it. All right, my next thing is from Mally Beauty. So I'm gonna pronounce it. It's a volumizing mascara. The full size is $20. There's what that looks like. I don't know if I've ever had a mascara that came in a white tube. That's kind of cool. I don't know. I know it's just like the color of packaging, but it's like interesting looking to me. Anyway. The celeb makeup artist Molly, 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 Mally, Mally Ronkel designed this lash plumping formula to give you glamorous va va boom lashes. So, got this mascara. Ooh, and there's what the wand looks like. And this feels like and looks like a much drier mascara formula than what I'm used to. So that'll be interesting to see how that works. Let's see, the next thing is from Tata Harper. It's a resurfacing mask. The full size is $58. It says, this potent mask targets excess oil, evens tone, and sheds dead cells to give your skin a healthy, all natural glow. I might actually use this like tonight. I'm filming this video on Monday, so yeah. Hi Riley. Riley just brought a big toy all the way upstairs. I don't know why, but that's, that was that weird noise. Wow. Anyway, I will probably use this tonight. It's like a funky texture though, you see that? It's like jelly. So, I'm interested to see how it feels on the face. Yeah. So, I try to give updates in my vlogs occasionally if a product is like really 
wow or like I happen to be wearing it and remember that I got it in a birch box so if you watch my vlogs there's a chance that you will find out what I thought of these products but I can't promise that I will remember to mention all of them because I just forget like that. I also forgot to take off Riley's collar. And now that's obnoxious. I'm sorry. All right, my final thing is from Tokyo Milk Dark. It's the Pretty Rotten Perfume. The full size is $42. And this is the packaging that it came in. It says, inspired by fairy tales, this mossy scent pairs layers of ambrosia apple and queen amber rose with green leafy notes. I don't know how I feel about this one. Generally, the samples that I get perfume-wise from Birchbox are like really good and I love them, but this is kind of, I don't know. Maybe it's the rose underneath the apple that I'm not liking. Because when I can smell the apple, I really like that part, but that rose is kind of strong underneath it. So I'm not sure how I feel about that, but anyway, that is all that I have for Birchbox this month. Make sure you guys leave me a comment down below if you also get Birchbox and tell me what you thought of everything that came in your box. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and make sure that you subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed already. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!